Good evening, everyone and people and everyone. Uh, we're going to do a bit of a mixed stream tonight. Um, I, I'm got something under my mat. Sorry. Uh, I've got some boxes I need to open, which I'm just going to lean over and pick them up. Uh, yay. Hello, everyone. Hello, Adam. Uh, I, yeah, your two names, whatever they are, and Tomo, and Deadstay, and Tomb, Doom Fairies, thanks for the sub, stay, that is much appreciated, um, well, I'm gonna open some, I've got three booster boxes, which I don't think is enough for a full stream, um, but my supplier let me down, it should have been five boxes for tonight, um, but yes, we're going to open them, if I get them all opened, in time, I'm going to clear the mat away, and I'll get some a bit of painting done. Um, I've got some special marines that need painting, and some um, tesseract green figures. My new mat. My new mat. Uh, uh, yes, uh, I must thank. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, um, Yes, names are uh, not my forte. Uh, Hammertron from Discord for the map. Um, an amazing trade uh, last week that got my nice new shiny find centre mat. Um, Ninja Boy stuff. And I know Steel appreciate Ninja Boy stuff. Um, so, we have the giveaway system I think is working. So if people check points, it might it should come up if it hasn't stopped working already. Um, so we're going to have a giveaway around about 8, 8.30. Uh, and it is for Levia and Prism. Whoa, that reminds me to turn that light off. Uh, remind me to put it back on for painting. Uh, so they're going to be available. Um, Kinga, just the person. Uh, it's broke again, hasn't it, Steve? Good evening, old freak. Uh, so the point system is a thing built into uh, Streamlabs that allows you to basically enter raffles, and the raffles go, you accrue points for watching the stream. And it worked up there, but at the moment it's so hit and miss, it's, um, I've been told to try, uh, to try a different one. Uh, but what we'll do is, uh, uh, if it doesn't work, all I'll do is I'll open two boxes. If it's not working after the two boxes, then what I will do is um, do a final box. People gamble on, not gamble, people foretell the future of, predict, that's the word, predict um, what Majestic we're going to get, and then they can win it from that. Not the Majestic, the, the nice coal foil, uh, the nice prism box toppers. So this could be the footstep stream. Um, but my look of late, ooh, I don't know. This is it, we'll go through it. Uh, Herald of Tenacity to start with our foils. Uh, some iron hide legs and an inverted existence. Great start. Um, I've turned the cloud bot off for the time being, so uh, it's going well, Kinga. We are starting events. Our first event was Sunday with a little bit of a warm up, um, learn to play event where we got some people on board and gave some nice shiny decks away. Oh, Enigma Chimeras. Uh, they are very nice Enigmas. Um, and Seeping Shadows. So, yes, we've got that. Uh, but this Friday, we've got our first um, Armoury event. Uh, our first proper Pucker official all-singing, all-dancing Armoury event. Um, and 
we have pound for pound in foil. Captain's call. There's prison. So that will be Friday at 7 o'clock. Yeah, I know. The, we had a week where um, I managed to blow the cam camera up. Um, so unfortunately, I didn't get a chance to do any streaming. Uh, hello, Hammertron. We've just been talking about you and the nice, nice, shiny, shiny map. Uh, Sunday, I believe we've got a... Oh, Foil Mark of the Beast. Um, it is a lovely mat. <laughs> we have a draft event on... Uh, oh, and Phantasmaclasm. Two in one. Tomo. Um, it was the one that was meant to happen last week that Steve's got his dates mixed up. Uh, so at the moment, unless things change, we don't have uh, anything on. Uh, we we haven't got anything planned because Steve's using the area. Uh, unworldly bellow. So yeah, that was a good, a good double majestic box. So yes, uh, welcome, welcome Hammer to the uh, Protech uh, stream and Dimensional Gateway. Pulping and Prismatic Shield Red. Prismatic Shield Red is good for a rare. So I am very scruffy because it's been one of those days where I had so much on. I got up early, jumped in the shower, I uh, forgot to get a shave and do my hair. So you've got rough and ready Lee today. You get rough and ready Lee quite a lot. Uh, thank you for the follow, mate. So yes, if I can get this up and running, oh, Blood Tribute, that has got to be uh, one of my favourite cards from this set. The foiling on the blood is bonkers. That is gorgeous. Uh, I might have to get myself a play set of them uh, if I can find a singles trader out there. <laughs> I've always been a bit of rough. Oh, cross the line. I do like this. It's um, it's a very nice piece of art, and the foiling just the glint off the sword. Uh, if there was a, I do like Warrior. I love the interactions with Warrior. Um, ah, thank you, Holfrick. Yeah, the the blood tribute foils, gorgeous. Uh, oh, hi, it's I. <laughs> um, we have a valiant thrust. We've discussed it quite a few times on the uh, the streams about the foiling on these cards and how different to every other game. Um, yes, thank you, Ulfric. As usual, you are a star. Pound for pound, spew shadow, herald of ravages. Um, we we will get back to the normal streams with the normal um, donations and all that sort of stuff. Um, and I'll get back to painting stuff. As I say, if I can uh, get through these boxes, uh, I, I'll actually paint some stuff. Uh, herald of protection. Thank you for the sub. Again, Ulfric, and thank yeah, thank you very much, guys. Uh, Captain's call. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and invigorating light. Yeah, the foiling on these cards is ridiculous. V for Vanguard in foil is unreal. Um, we did, as I say, we did. We got our first kit through this week, um, which is the V for Vanguard mat, and that mat. Uh, I'm not a light player, but that mat is really, really pretty. Um, You're a superstar, old frick. And Soul Reaping in foil looks beautiful as well. Uh, 
Yeah, I can only apologize. I, um, I need to sort some um, workings tonight. Um, oh, look at that. Double overload. Uh, one's file. The unhallowed, right? Uh, yeah, I need to work some, some shums out tonight. Uh, it means you don't get adverts and stuff like that. Uh, people can subscribe to the stream. And that helps us keep, basically keep the lights on and buy new power supplies for cameras when they overheat and blow up. Bolting blade. So, oh, that is our only, only our fourth one. Um, so basically, Ulfrix gifted people some subs um, for a month, so you get a month subscription, which means you get some cool Star Wars. Bolt of Courage is another really nice one. Uh, some co co cool Star Wars emotes um, and yes it only happens when it's left on for some time and melts <laughs> uh, oh Genesis foil they're nice another nice coloured one uh, I have to admit um, I until I started streaming, I didn't know much about Twitch at all. Um, I watched uh, my friend Rasta on uh, his Weekend Warlords stream once a week, and that was just about it. Yeah, I I, I used to do the same, and now I'm ooh, riding Beast Hulk. Um, I'm now a year over a year into. Uh, doing streams, I think we've got, we broke the year uh, barrier and we broke the 150 streams barrier, something like that, which is quite scary. Uh, Herald of Ravages, Merciful Retribution, that's another one of Eleanor, I like the artist Eleanor, I can never remember a second name, but yeah, we, we need, we do a, a stream uh, for charity once a year. Oh, we do an event uh, called the Imperial March once a year for charity. Boneyard Marauder. Um, Herald, Herald of... That one. Uh, and last year we did absolutely... F yes, we did absolutely fantastic. I streamed for 24 hours straight. And to say I was a gibbering wreck at the end of it was an understatement. Uh, we had some iron hide legs. Oh, I thought I'd got a, a legendary there. Uh, and Phantasmify. It, was, it wasn't It was meant to be... Yeah, womp womp. It wasn't meant to be a 48 hours. I would have literally imploded. Uh, so, yeah, we're, we're going to look at something again. Adrenaline Rush. Um, don't know if it'll, we'll get it in this year. Um, but we will try. Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, they are. Um, I went back about a month ago and watched the last half hour of mine. And I jabbered on solidly about some crap that I've got no idea what I was talking about. A bit like most of my streams, but... Seeds of Agony, it's another good one. I do like the foiling on seeds. <gasps> wow, Kinger. And Seeping Shadows. I'm going to go out on a limb and say this was slightly below par. Two, four, six. Six Majestics. Six Majestics. <sighs> Palpitations. How am I meant to make money off these things? Yeah, I had people in the in the because I'm not in the store while I do these. Um, these are actually done in up in the house. Um, the studio's all set up now. <laughs> yes, I definitely want the play set of all the foil ones. I'm still waiting for my personal boxes. Um, you guys are getting all of this stuff put up on the website before I even. Get mine through. Um, how did your box go yesterday, Scott? Only 
Yeah, red's all you need. Uh, ghastly Memorial Ground. And... That, again, it's a good starter. Yeah, you get them like that. Foil Soul Field. Foil Death Reaper. Nice. And Watcher and Herald, Soul Harvest, Pulpings. Rising Beaks, Tulks, Valiant Thrust. Slow down, Lee. I, I got to this point last time where I was just rattling through because I had to finish before. Um, a certain time, but I don't need to now. Phantasmoclasm. So we're up to two. Two Majestics. Oh, that's not too bad. Uh, it's better than what I'm pulling at the moment. Herald of Tenacities. And plow through. So hopefully Cloud Bot will work because um, when my friend was over here and um, we forgot to discuss Moot Bot. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't think someone in the chat's going to be saying nice. <laughs> um... I didn't even get sleeves ready. I am such... Everyone needs a husk. <laughs> um, yeah. I've got someone wanting a, a card out of this set really, really bad, and I've been trying to get him it for forever. Um... What a carry on, yeah. Yeah, the thing is, that is my most pulled card now. Yeah, I need footsteps for um, Sweeney. So I've pulled uh, Frontline Scout. We pulled six of them out of the first edition, and I think that's number six out of Unlimited uh, Mark of the Beast. So yeah, I, I I definitely am someone who keeps pulling the husk. That sounds wrong. That sounds very wrong. Uh, yin e anti. Yeah, it is a good problem to have. Um, but we've also pulled a lot of poop, poop boxes as well. Not as bad as Dead Stay's box. I think we've had one close where it was like f four super rares. Um, Water and Herald, that's nice. And Ord to Wrath. And boom, boom, stubby hammerers. I thought that I thought we nearly had a double majestic box there. I was going to start running around. Oh, that's not a bad pack. Tome of Torment. That. This is a nice box. Yes, his, his was an Arcane Rising box. Um, I don't know if... Oh, another Seeds in Foil. Oh. I don't know if you follow Kitchen Table TCG. They've got a great section working out um, the average box values and stuff like that. Uh and at the moment, Monarch does upset me because it's way low. So I know every time I'm buying these boxes in, I'm mainly doing it to get people cards and hopefully hitting the things that um, people like Sweeney need. Uh, how much was this? This was that much. Yeah. For 
from the order that I did for six boxes, I need to pull two of them to be, be round about breaking even. Yeah, Sweeney doesn't need cards, I know. <laughs> um, yeah, that's uh, Tabletop TCG. So, I keep meaning to patronise him, or join his patroning. Whatever the, whatever the terminology is. I know it's not patronising. That word, anyway. Another Herald of Tenacities and an Out Muscle. Yeah, I, I can. I keep meaning to and keep forgetting. Uh, Spears of Serility. I follow. I watch his YouTube channel. Um, but yeah. That's it. Become a patron. Uh, Yinty Yanty. The foil Yinty Yanty is really interesting because the black's got foiling behind it as well. And that looks... Uh... Yes. Well... It... Oh, Soul Shield. Isn't that your favourite card, Scott? Soul Shield. Um... Thank you for the follow. This is much appreciated. You know, I hate it. I thought that was the other Halo, the legendary one there for a second. <sighs> Love me. Uh, so that's two foil. Three foil pieces of equipment. Yeah, the the halo is nice. That again, the foiling and the way the art overlays is fantastic. Consumings. I'm looking for a rare ball. That could be one of them. I think we've already got them in the shop as well, mate. I don't think that the. Yeah, that is cool. That. Oh, perfect angle of light. Uh, Brandish, Rally, Seek Horizon, and Battlefield Blitz. I've still got four packs left. <laughs> you need to use the call foil. Yeah, just just slab up the call foil, get it out there. Uh, imitate. It. Ooh, this is a bonkers box. Um, so that's a Luminar Ascension in cold, in cold, not cold foil. That's Scott cold, making me cold foil. Uh, normal foil, rainbow foils. Yeah, I th I th I'm almost certain I've got a cold foil in my deck for Husk. Um, rip through reality. <laughs> Seek Horizon. Deadwood Rambler. And a nourishing empty. What on earth is wrong with this box? Last pack. There can't be anything in this pack because I think we've had most of the set out here. And Rifted Torment. And then a Valiant Thrust. Cool. Yeah. It would have been a, a, a lot bonkers if I'd managed to um, pulse. So there's two. Uh, that's that one. I've still got another box, but what I'm going to do is move them up to there. And then go under there. I'm going to turn Cloudbot back on. And see if Cloudbot actually does anything.
Come on, Kalau, but jump into life. Is there any way to jump start cloud bot? say anything yeah it keeps coming up at the top when I do it it goes it's already a moderator it's been working fine for months we must have done hundreds of giveaways um, Can't see any reason in the system that it would be a pain in the butt. The only thing I can think of is did our no, because I've got Prime. Cheers, old frick. You're a star, mate. Um, I don't know what's going on with... Anything. I give up. So, what we're going to do is, because I can't get that working for reasons, uh, let me put the this bulk in here. Uh, we're going to do the giveaway of the two cards. Yeah, I'd, I might just have a look at it, see if I can muddle through myself. I managed to set this up, set up this piece of crud so I'll uh, I'll have a look at it and then see if uh, see how I can get around with it the thing is we pay for Streamlabs Pro so I might just shout at them and see what they say first uh, before ending the stream oh look at that yes thank much appreciated oh someone's been in me box Someone's been in my box. Um, it's not the first that we've had like that. And I know a lot of people have kicked up a fuss on one trade group saying they received packs that were opened. But uh, if anyone is out there that has had issues like this, there's proof that it's... We'll open that first. But competition time. Ooh. Ooh. You might be correct there. Um, speaking of crimps, I hear crimps are worth money. I think the only one that isn't is that one. So 
file, 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 not 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 file, but yeah. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11 crimps that I've still got no idea how to sell or what to sell them at and that sort of stuff, but that's for another day. So, competition. We'll do it the good old fashioned way. Everyone gets to name. Yeah, there's I'm on a I'm on a forum for it. Uh, there, yeah, there is a forum for misprints and crimps and stuff like that. Because at first we thought one of my eyes, not these eyes, my eye of a videos was a misprint, but I found out it wasn't. So in chat. Uh, I'll give you two minutes. I'll give you the time that it takes me to go and get a can of juice or drink out of the fridge. Um, name the first Majestic that I pull, foil or normal, out of these. The first two people with correct answers. So first will be Levia, second will be Prism. There we go. Tomo's first in. So name, it has to be from um, Monarch as well. Ping, 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 ping. Spill blood. How? <laughs> so, for those who <laughs> Smash with you. That's not a a majestic mate. So I'm gonna have a look at crimp pack. As long as I haven't pulled it and you name it, I'll still take the uh, the names. No, no crimps on that end. And no crimps on that end. So yeah, wallop with a larger tree. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. So for anyone who didn't know, um, so last time we did this, um, Howling Minds Pete picked Luminar Ascension every time and the only time we did five boxes and gave away th two cards so every time he picked it it didn't actually come out but the other boxes there was plenty in the other boxes so let's go uh, Seek Enlightenment Recital Adrenaline Rush Spew Shadow and Stony Wootenhog Every other, <laughs> um, a stony root and hog, and no majestic. So pack one safe. I'm classing that as a repack, and I want a refund. Uh, stony, uh, deep rooted evil. Did we have any deep rooted evil in the chat? Hexagos, and that, uh, Illuminate, blood, no. That one escapes. And Battlefield Blitz. Yes, there is loads. Fuck. That... <laughs> oh, there's definitely Lee Deep Rooted Evil. Oh, that's gorgeous, that card. across the line and unhallowed rights come on david pick a card and not deep rooted evil it needs to be a majestic graveling growl hmm. graveling and growls v for vanguard and Oh, Celestial Cataclysm. Did we have a Celestial? We didn't. Hmm. That 
that's still not a majestic. These rules need to be better explained to people. Dusk Path Pilgrimage. And Soul Reaping. I know. And because of karma and stuff like that, you know what's going to happen? We're going to pull two Majestics that people have chosen the thing. And then we're going to pull a Luminar Ascension. I can just feel it. And Herald of Rebirth. <laughs> uh, Shadow of Versa. Tome of Divinity. Who was the other Tom? Tom of Torment and Tom of Divinity. Cool. So we have we have a valid answer from David. And pound for pound. We're there. Double tremor. <laughs> I don't think there's going. I think you might miss it. Uh, Spew shadow and another stony wooten hog. Phantasmify. Nearly phantasmaclasm. The thing is, David, when you had to look it up, it then became embossed in your memory that you would know that Tome of Divinity is now a majestic. A dimensional gateway. And Howl from Beyond. Ghostly visit. And Guardians of the Shadow Realm? No. That's four. We haven't got many hits left in this box. Lunar Tide, Memorial Ground, and Express Lightning. Rising Beast Hulk. <laughs> I think the whole box is going to be a swing and a miss again. I've had my legendary. Uh, so that'd be the only one I'm getting out of this set. Pulping. Pulping is class. Pulping is good as swing with big tree. Uh, prismatic shield. I just cracked my thumb there. That hurt. Endless more. And dimensional gateways. Dread Screamer. And Captain's Call. Herald of Protection and Rise Above. We've had a lot of good sales on the foil cards. Um, people wanting to bling out their decks. They seem very popular. We've got a lot of first edition stuff, uh, but the Unlimited seems very popular. I don't know if it's because it's cheap or... Okay, I'll take that. Um, who had Vestige of Sol? <laughs> I'll take it. <laughs> and oh, Hexagor. Um, who had a Hexagor? Is that Blumin Tomo again? Is this the second Hexagor that he's won on? Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> it is majestic. So I was double L case, yeah. Double L case. It's the only one you knew. <laughs> well, you best get you best get working it out now because you've now got a levia um, to build a deck around uh, in promo foil, and you've also got a uh, Ira deck to build it round. Yeah, catch you later, stay. Uh, we still have one. If you win it, stay. I'll keep it and not tell you. Don't worry. Uh, Rifted torment and plow through. And Captain's Call. Yeah, catch you later, mate. I'll let you both know, honest, if I pull the card that you need. That would win you the Prism being the next one. Where's Ash when Prism's been offered on uh, the stream? Express Lightning. Tome of Torment. Um, I'm sure someone had Tome. Nope, no one. Okay, we'll move on quite quickly. <laughs> oh, you were too late. <laughs> uh, consuming us. At least you got something today. Uh, well done, mate. Uh, so, Levy is going to... Tomo and Prism gets to go to the nice <laughs> off by off by one. Oh, I'm guessing you wanted Levia. Why did you want Levia? Didn't you want Prism? I'm almost certain you were building a Prism deck. Oh, Ironhide Helm. And Vexing Malice. There were, you know there was two giveaways. So the first person got Levier and the second one got Prism. But if you... Oh, secret reasons. Oh. See, he picks all of the... Oh, Blood Tribute again. Um, sort it out in the stream between you. I don't mind. You can have whichever one you want. Press lightning and an oot, oot muscle. Talisman, Minimism, Pound for Pound, Rising Soul Tide, Herald of Rebirth, and our final card is. Oh, Guardians. Is that two of them? Just two of them. Two Guardians of the Shadow Realm in the same box. I know Sweeney might be a bit in between on his street, uh, and he's getting back to Pipnos because he's uh, he's one of these posh people that has two kitchens in his house. So there's a nice shiny pile of foils um, to go into stock with them lot. Um, so from three boxes. I'm fairly happy with what we've got done. So, Carrion Husk and a Vestige. Einhide Legs, Stubbies and Helm and stuff like that. Hello, matey. Uh, so, we had any foils in there. Uh, Deep Rooted Evil. Luminar Ascension in foil. I'm sure there was a, a Genesis in foil. Mark of the Beast in foil. Um, so they're the big, big hitters today. Two majestic, uh, two legendaries from three boxes is uh, amazing. Uh, we also got four foil 
Majestics. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen normal Majestics and four. Um, for shiny pieces of equipment. Uh, so yeah, I'm pleased with that haul. It is a it is a sexy haul. Um them two beasties. <sighs> Very nice. I, I'll take that as a win in the uh, um the shop today. So I need to sort them ones out later. Lots of stuff to do on. Actually, I'm the sexier hall. <laughs> Thank you for the submit. Um, yes, you cheered me up today, saying you were coming. I'm looking forward to seeing you. Uh, so yes, that is the three boxes. To say I'm happy is an understatement. Um, I let you two decide between you which who gets what. So let us know which one you want, Sweeney, uh, Levy or Prism, and then we'll sort that out. So the only thing I can't do is switch over to the painting uh, setup, uh, and I'm definitely not painting on the map. So uh, because, as you can see from the underneath, that gets very mucky under there. Um, so what we'll do is, uh, obviously it is only quarter to eight, uh, I'm going to put the mat away, I'm going to sit and chill, talk to you and put some paint down. I'm not going anywhere, but if you are then, yep, yeah, I'll just sit and paint with people that are, are chilling out tonight. Um... Is Kinga still around? Because Kinga's going to be so impressed. Well, I'm not so impressed. I can't even get them off. Yes, catch us all later. See you for the next uh, Flesh and Blood one. Hopefully, by the weekend, I might have some more stock coming through. With any luck. What day is it today? It's Wednesday today. Um, yeah, but it's good fun. I went and played Sealed at uh, Living Realms, not last weekend, the weekend before, um, at their uh, big event. The, well, I was going to call it a calling, but that's the bigger, bigger event. The... Hmm... No, um, I'm not playing at the expo. Um, we're going down as uh, Protech, so I've got businessy stuff to get on with. Uh, the thing is, as you know, being at the expo, half the time I was going down and playing X Wing, I was dropping out halfway through because there was just so many business opportunities to pick up and grab um, and yeah Expo is part business well, probably predominantly business for us going down so you do bright green stuff for Kinger and he disappears yeah yeah oh. I'm not going to lie, I was looking forward to judging. Um, but maybe it's next time. So, 
so stuff I've got on the table at the moment and it's not going through very fast at all is I'm doing a set of um, Imperial Fists for a friend um, there is like a, a squad of ten of them all in the yellow all ready to to go um, but these are for me. Uh, I'm doing them for Stargrave uh, with Ronan, who's probably sat playing Stargrave now with Jack. Two of my viewers. Oh, I can't believe they're out playing games. Um, but yeah, we played it last week and it was really good fun. Um, I just needed different... I'm running droids, so... I went down the route of, I'm going to have um, commando droids and super battle droids. I've got Cad Bane in green as well, which uh, Kinga would have loved. I know it's no, no Smaug, but it is just as good. Um, and then, I need my brush. I'm just going to quickly do some weapons and stuff like that. Changing glasses. Yeah, I was definitely looking forward to doing uh, judging with you guys. But I'm guessing with the nothing being on, it'll keep till next time. I don't know if we're doing anything. Uh, I don't know if Asma Day are doing anything the day before as they usually do for um, retailers. I know they don't have much planned for the actual expo itself. But uh, yeah, it'd be nice to see what's in store again. If that makes sense. And as you said, I think it's just going to be good to see everyone. People I've been talking to on the phone for 18 months and not getting to actually physically see them. And then a weekend of seeing someone is going to be fantastic. As long as the UK doesn't mess it up. So I'm just using contrast black. Uh, it will leave a slight tint of green, but I'm not too bothered about that. Uh, I'll put a quick dry brush over the top of it as well, just to, to uh, drop it down a bit, mute, mute it down. Cameras beeping at me. I will do this blurred and I'll see what the camera issue is. I think you can see that on there. It's actually, uh, can I get it to, it doesn't come through much, but there's just like a, a slight glow to it. I don't know if that makes sense, um, but it just sort of, a little bit of that. 
Um, it gives the feel that it's got a bit like Tron running through it, that sort of um, effect you know, without having to do the hundreds of little lines to it's got someone there as well so I think yeah they're quite easy to do um, it's just using the contrast you put it on fairly liberally and it um, it falls into the recesses, gives a dark patch, and it also stops it from um, it, basically it stops it from just looking like you've co coated it in black. It, it gives a bit of definition to the the peaks and the troughs and the handle underneath without hitting the fingers which isn't very easy and there we go oh missed a bit missed a bit oh <sighs> it did beep as well didn't it Yeah. The camera's melting. Um, I didn't. I do have a fan up there. So let's give it. 30 seconds of cooling and see if it works if not it's going to be another bloody short stream this one's got binoculars It's weird here today. It's been raining a lot. But, yeah. Heat. Cameras. The camera runs hot anyway because it's on a power supply. On a new power supply as well. Um, so. I couldn't afford the. Yeah, my t last time it did it, it took a. A minute to cool down a bit um, but if it doesn't then it might be an early an early showers for us so to speak um, yeah I couldn't afford the new the proper Nikon um, power supply for it it's like 250 quid and obviously we've not been doing any of the um, the proper streams to to keep the money coming in so unfortunately I had to buy a cheap one and I say cheap it was still 60 quid but I have a feeling it's not up to the job either and I do understand that the first time it failed was definitely my fault for leaving it on for a little bit too long <laughs> but uh, we will get there
the fan stopped. I think the charges ran out on the fan. Um, what I'll do is I'll finish off these two guns and quickly show you them on the big camera. So disappointed because the definitely Tesseract, Kinga was here and now we've missed them. Disgraceful. Remind me to remind him next time that he ran off just as we were getting the Tesseract out. Did we have the big overhead camera last year during the summer or was I still using the um, webcams? I have a feeling I was still using the two webcams and I didn't have this um, expensive setup. I didn't have it because I haven't had the one year anniversary of it being uh, needing its warranty upgrading because so I've got a thingy upgrade a free one year upgrade on the warranty but I needed to reset it that's why uh, why couldn't it have been on the bloody power supply so I so said next week we will go back to streaming some more painting. I've got a couple of things on the table that I want to do. Um, what I'm also going to do is I bought in a box of um, Marvel Crisis, and the Marvel Crisis basically is. Um, Oh, hello. Yep, cool. We're back. We're back. We're back. Uh, so the Marvel Crisis is. Um, it needs a little bit more work on it from um, what the owner did. So it just needs a bit of TLC to get it finished off. So I was thinking of doing basically a bit of a series of fixing it up, like we did with the um, oh, what are they called the I was going to say droidicas, but that's not droidicas. The knights, mini knights. Um, and if I can basically have the mini knights up and running, that would be cool. Uh, so I'll sniper, I'll just finish up a little bit under his. Under the. And he's done. So, yes. Uh, right so we've got them I can get them done now and then after them these don't need these just need silvering so they're quite good um, he needs a gun he needs a gun doing he needs a gun these just need a little bit of silvering so they're good they won't take long at all uh, it's gone again right I'm yeah. I'm going to gracefully bow out at that. Um and Yeah, that's definitely flat. Um and then hope for some bad weather to stop this from happening. So I'll try we'll see what's happening over the weekend. Um we have our event on Friday for um uh, flesh and blood armory event our first one so if people want to come along to that and then saturday we have the digimon event um, that ronan is organizing so there's a digimon event then uh 
they're all over on the cam set up so yeah i shall if you're there i'll see you for that if not i'll catch you next wednesday hopefully so in the meantime stay safe and we catch you soon yeah same here mate